it's Jazz Rose and today I am doing another haul for you guys. Today I am trying out Motel or Motel Rocks. I have no idea what this brand is called. Motel, Motel Rocks, I don't know. So for the sake of this video, we're calling it Motel because it's shorter. You may have heard of Motel through Instagram. It's like very trendy clothing, but has like this retro vibe. You'll find Motel in lots of clothing boutiques like Princess Polly and Dolls Kill, but we don't shop there, do we? For today's video, I am putting Motel to the test to see if they are big boob friendly and if they are average body friendly. I don't think I've ever seen someone with a bigger chest modeling or like in just wearing motel clothes um so i want to see like if they actually cater for people with you know like a bit of a tummy or love handles or big boobs i shopped in the sales section because uh, it's it's a bit expensive on the website. So I only shopped on the sales section. Actually, there's one there's one dress that I bought that wasn't on sale. I still uh, found a discount code for it, but it wasn't in the sales section. So if you see anything ugly today, just think like, oh, that's why it's on sale. I'm gonna go ahead and try the first thing on. I will link everything down below, even if I'm not into it. Someone that watches this might be. So. Everything will be linked down below as well as the sizes that I got for them. The first thing I'm going to try is a dress. It, this is the one thing that wasn't on sale. I'm pretty sure that this costs $70. I don't think, honestly, I don't think it is worth $70. Just feeling it. They had so many colors in this dress. They have so many different, like patterns and colors in a lot, like most of their products. So with this one, I got a black rose dress. I got this in a size medium, so that is my usual size. So I'll let you know if it's true to size or not. You might not have a big chest like I do, but hopefully me saying if it's true to size or not does help. Let's just try it on. It's a little tight. I would have gone a size large in this. Or maybe it's not meant for big boobs because it's only tight around this area. I mean, my stomach area is like a little tight because I have a bit of a gut, um, but it's not as tight as like this whole area here. I thought it was meant to be a little bit oversized. Looking in the mirror, I have a mirror like here, it, I don't feel good. Like, I, I feel like I don't look nice. I can't show you the whole dress because it is a midi dress, but you can probably see, like, the gist of it. It has a slit right here. The slit is, like, a good, a good height. I don't like slits where it goes up so high that I'd have to be, like, covering myself up the whole time. It's just a little tight. And I don't I don't think I would wear this out because I'd be too self-conscious. This is what it looks like from the side. You can see a bit of a belly. It's kind of flattening my boobs out and giving me just one big mono boob. The back is good. It doesn't go down too far, so it's not showing my bra. But the dress as a whole, I'm not liking it. I'm just not feeling it. I feel really restricted and I don't like when I have a mono boob. Well, we're off to a great start, aren't we? Next, I have this midi skirt. I think it's a midi skirt or a maxi skirt. Doesn't say. Anyway, I got this in a size small. It's not stretchy up here, so it probably won't fit me. This skirt also has a slit. It looks like it's up pretty high, but we'll see when it's on. They had so many other colors and patterns and stuff that I just, I think this was the nicest out of all of them. And looking at it now, it's, it's not that nice. Like, it's too bright. <sighs> I should have gone a medium. The small is so tight, I almost couldn't do it up. I am so disgusted looking in the mirror. All I can see is my gut hanging out. <laughs> the slit is up way too high for my liking. This top isn't from Motel, by the way. I just chucked a random top on. See how high the slit is? Not into it. <laughs> this makes me very self-conscious just knowing that this much leg is out. Now I'm sorry that I can't show you the whole thing. I can't push my camera back any further or I can't zoom out any further. Um, but as you can see, 
there's a lot of there's a lot of me hanging out. I think a size medium would have been so much better. I don't think it was available in a medium because it was in the sale section. So I thought a small would have been fine. It was $35, so this was probably $70. This is kind of sad. I feel really bad for like not liking their stuff because they are so hyped up on Instagram. But at least you are like knowing what it's like before you end up buying something that you don't like. Oh, by the way, I am stuck with this stuff. I'm stuck with it because they only give you 14 days. You had only 14 days from the day they sent it to initiate a return. But in my case, I could only film one day a week. I bought this stuff to film a video and I was two days late. So now I'm stuck with all this stuff. Anyway, let's move on to the next item, which is a top. My expectations have just gone way down. <laughs> My expectations have just gone even lower. <laughs> this, why did I buy this? I can already tell just looking at where the seams are for like where my boobs are meant to fit. This is not going to fit me. This is not going to look good on me. This is a size large. So I would expect a size large top to fit me, but the boob part isn't, isn't big enough. <laughs> so I'm not sure if this is meant to be off the shoulder, but I think I would rather wear it on the shoulder just so it might give me a bit of support. Um, I'm going to try this on with a bra and then I'll take my bra off to show you. Um, but you know, just a warning, my boobs are heavy and I don't like them. I am the definition of sad boobs, okay? Just a warning. All right, let's try this on. <laughs> okay, I meant it when I said I have sad boobs, all right? This is where the seam is, and then my boobs end like down here. So my bra is showing a lot. If I was to put the seam like where my boob actually ends, does that make sense? Um, then this much would be showing. It does have this string which I'm assuming, oh, that's better. But then it just brings the seam straight back up. So I don't know what the go is with that. I'm just gonna tie it up. I don't think it's as cute off the shoulder that it is on the shoulder. Like it is a cute top. I paid $30. So this was probably in like the 50s or 60s. These are in Australian dollars, by the way. This is the side, if that shows anything. And then here is the back. It doesn't go down low at all. This is embarrassing. So. I can't. I can't look in the mirror. This is with my boobs like lifted to fit in the seam. They look like they're about to fall out. I told you I have sad boobs. <laughs> look at this. I can't. I can't. But then this is if I want to actually cover up my boobs. They've just like the only part in this like above seam part is my nipple. <laughs> The rest of my boob has just like fallen down. And can you see how it's like cut my boob in half? This has no support. And the longer I look in the mirror, the longer I want to just cry. I'm just gonna get down low to show you this next thing. Um, so this is another crop top. I need to stop getting tops in this style, but I like it so much. It's got that ruched drawstring detail. I've got a good feeling about this one because it's actually like, it looks like there's enough room for my boobs and I can wear a bra with it. I got good hopes about this one. Usually this style does fit me, so I, yeah. I got this in a size large. I paid $25 and that's a really good price. I know it was on sale, I know that wasn't the original price, but 25 bucks is good for something like this. I've noticed that the material for all the things I've tried on so far is the exact same. It's all right, it's okay. I think so far this is the only thing I'm wanting to keep. It is like a bit roomy, like I could have gone a size medium. I reckon this top would look good with some blue jeans. Maybe not like skinny jeans, but like wide leg jeans. That might look nice, but I could be wrong. <laughs> this is good. I think I should loosen this a little bit because it's a bit um, high for me. Does my bra show? Makes me cleavage do that, but 
Oh yeah, my bra's showing a little bit. So yeah, I should loosen it a little bit. <laughs> this is the back, so perfect to wear a bra with. Yeah, pretty much the only thing I need to say about this is just... I could have sized down. It's nice. This skirt, oh my God. I didn't even want it, but it was $7. I know it was $70 because I was like, I was saying multiple times, oh my God, I cannot believe this $70 skirt is $7. So this is a satin look. I think it's like a bit stretchy, a mini skirt, and it has a slit on the side, which I think is going to be way too high. The thing that makes it like, hideous is this buckle at the front like i know this was a trend at festivals and stuff but it's it's a bit ugly <laughs> like it is literally a seat belt i got this in a size medium um i just i can't believe i got this for seven dollars okay okay <sighs> I, I changed my mind <laughs> i was going to say it looks okay but it's super short but then i looked in the mirror and everything's hanging out like my my gut is spilling over it's so short if i pull it down like pull it down for a photo sure but then you move once and the whole thing just rides right up so this is where it would usually sit right um this is just unnecessary <laughs> so here is how high the slit goes up i'll pull it down that's fine but then you know, I move and it's so high up. The dress, the skirt is so short. You can probably see all my rolls. I'm sucking in because I'm scared. <laughs> it's not cute. I'm looking in the mirror and I can see my underwear. I'm just standing. <laughs> this haul is great, isn't it? I hope it's helping you guys though. I have a dress. As you can see, my boobs are meant to go in a place that they probably won't go. I paid 40 bucks for this dress. Um, as I said before, it's the same, um, pattern and material and stuff as, oh, the top I'm wearing. <laughs> so this is a midi dress. I got it in a size medium. The straps are questionable, like very stretchy. <laughs> this also has a slit. I reckon Motel got really popular because of like the slits in their clothing because it looks very flattering when the slit looks good. <laughs> yeah, the thing that worries me about this dress is, I don't know how well you can see it on camera, but they have seams and they're not leaving much room for, you know, a larger chest to fit. Why don't clothing companies do this? This kind of style is a trend and it looks good. It looks cute, but no one is making it for big boobs. Let's just, um, see how we go. I'll try it with a bra and then I'll take my bra off and cry <laughs> mate this dress is not even cute it's cutting my boob in half right now but then i pull it down for it to fit in the seam and like i, <laughs> I don't like this dress it's not even cute i feel ugly like 100% honest right now i feel ugly i definitely could have sized up to a large because my gut is hanging out and you can see my belly button, you can see like where my undies are because my fat is spilling over. The slit is up so high, I literally look like I'm wearing an apron. This is the back for anyone who's interested and this is me on the side. I just, I feel so unattractive right now. And now I'm going to see what it looks like without a bra. Look at the straps by the way. Like, <laughs> I have heavy boobs. They're gonna pull these straps down. <laughs> this is so bad. Look at me from the side. No, don't look at me from the side. I don't even wanna, I don't even wanna show you anymore. I don't feel good. I don't feel good in these clothes. I only liked that green top, that's it. It could just be the items that I chose and the sizes that I got. They're not really true to size. Um, but I am just, I'm not happy. Honestly, I wouldn't shop at Motel again. Maybe if I had more money to spend, I might buy like some more like full price stuff. I can buy jumpers, I can buy trackies. I don't know, just not anything that has to accommodate your boobs. I feel so self-conscious right now, but I'm still gonna upload this video because I hope it helps someone out. I don't know how it's gonna help you, but 
I, I don't know. Anyway, guys, if you like this video somehow, make sure to give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. Follow me on Instagram at jazzrose28. And if you would like to see more of my videos, make sure to subscribe if you're not already. That will really mean a lot to me. I don't know why I just clapped there. And until next time, goodbye.